Hello everyone, welcome back to part 3 of my Final Fantasy VII Remake playthrough. In the last episode, Cloud ran away from Shinra, jumped on the train, we saw Aerith, helped her fight off some weird shadow demons, and now we are on the train going back to Sector 7 uh, to see Tifa. They haven't said it yet, but that's where we're going. So let's see how we go through this train, through the checkpoints. She's in the freight car, too. Because of the evacuation order, maybe? This Lucky us. We've Sector got a crowd to hide here. Head for the Sector front of the train and hold there. Due to an explosion at Mako Reactor 1, an emergency schedule is now in effect. Your understanding and cooperation is appreciated. Don't crush the flower cloud. <coughs> don't need no reactors. Yeah, exactly. Wow. So many people. Hey, out of sack. Just leave me alone, all right? Why don't you learn to take a You're, hint, uh, buddy? Holding up pretty well, huh? Even after what we saw at the station and all over Sector Eight. I'm a soldier. Wow, my hands are still shaking. You get used to it. Mm. Something to look forward to. Or maybe not. You see, my daughter now lives in Sector 8, so... Little help, Cloud? Please? What you need, I can't Jessie? stop thinking about it. The bomb yeah. I made shouldn't have produced an explosion that big. It doesn't make any sense. The explosion triggered a reaction with the Mako. You said so yourself. <laughs> that was my first guess, but shouldn't a reactor have fail-safes to prevent that kind of thing? Mm -hmm. You mentioned invisible enemies back there, right? Right. Oh, no. I'm just looking for excuses for something that was clearly my own fault. Oh. <sighs> Gotta own up to it if I'm gonna learn from this and move on. Don't let Thanks, her blame Cloud. herself. You're a good listener. <sighs> what kind of maniacs would go so far as to bomb a reactor? <sighs> They've yet to announce it publicly, but I heard it was Avalanche's hey. doing. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? Is there nothing they won't do? Hey, <gasps> quit talking out your ass. <laughs> Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. <clears throat> just, just who do you think you are? Oh. A law-abiding concerned citizen. Law-abiding? Really? <laughs> oh, wow. Thank you. Somebody gets it. In my humble opinion, that explosion was a message. A message to the bastards bleeding our planet dry. Think they got it? Heard it loud and clear? Y'all's masters? <laughs> We will not submit to intimidation or violence, but work together for peace and prosperity. <laughs> that is how civilized people change the world. Nice canned it's response. Right. Oh my god, don't clap. That's the Shinra Creed. <laughs> Them's fighting words. <laughs> it's what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? <laughs> We should go. Right. <laughs> At least I got the point. Time for a little nap. I didn't hear anything. You hear that, Sue? Shinra creed my ass. <laughs> out of the way personally i find visual aids make the dull stuff a lot more bearable if it helps think of it as an initiation right cool. how many times do i have to tell you people i'm not there's such a thing as playing too hard to get <laughs> so here we've got a wireframe model of the great city of midgar complete with massive <coughs> steel plates suspended 300 meters above ground level atop which stands a shining beacon of civilization the whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors, 
which feed the insatiable appetites of the public. Mm -hmm. The train will be passing through an ID checkpoint shortly. This here is the train's route. As you can see, it'll take us around this main pillar. Look, we're about halfway through it now. They've set up a checkpoint here to scan the IDs of all passengers heading in and out. Date of birth, residential status, criminal history. All that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. <laughs> Don't worry. Our IDs are impeccable. <laughs> what I tell you? <coughs> have a little faith. Won't be, be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Piece of hell the old good dot. Look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there gotta struggle to survive. Shinra sucks up Mako. While the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog, and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> that's what's always worked for me. <sighs> well, that's all well and good. If you only out for yourself. But the folks down there don't have the luxury of choice, you know. <sighs> Are we gonna see it? Like this train, I suppose. There's only one way it can go. One, members lost zero. And one step closer to a brighter future. Hell yeah! Guys! Lower your voices, huh? People are listening. Oh, God. Right. Uh, hmm. Rookie. Now get some on uh. You've earned it. Just be ready for the next mission, all right? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> See you soon. Uh, at Seventh Heaven, you know where Tifa works. Don't keep her waiting; she'll worry. So what I was saying is that old dot, you know, the follow the dots around the center pillar thing on the original. It'll a whole lot better this time around. Are you sure you? How are people here, Tan? You seem cute. Can I get back on the train? No. Guess I'll stop by one of the. What are we even doing here? No one in their right mind. Talk about I'm going on a ghost hunt. Of course. There are a lot of people. Somehow. Huh? How about it, baby girl? Uh, how about Train services have been. Hey. Huh? They'll sell and stuff? Job offer. Oh, hey. Yeah. I wish I could one tell drink you, in Walmart. but sadly, I don't share your passion for processing. <laughs> That's so cool. One slum slider with extra black milly, please. Slum slider? I Ugh. think he's over by the TVs. Oh, no words can describe how kind of the person oh, that's reactor. so weird. The kind of person who goes around putting up flyers all over the slums, I expect. Avalanche. That sounds familiar. Dumb plate he's only had it so good because of the reactors. That's so cool. Who are you? Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Yeah, the hell it is. That's his voice? Goddamn eco warriors with their dumbass posters. I tear them down and they're back up inside of an hour. <laughs> like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steelwork. You trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> What the? You okay, buddy? <sighs> Mako Junkie, huh? Figures. <laughs> you 
you again. Do we follow those or? No, we're just gonna let them go. I'm not a junkie. That hot shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. Warning. Gate broken. Fiends in area. <laughs> Exercise caution. Huh. No reason to check it out. Not my problem. Ugh, how many times are you gonna say that, Cloud? Um, excuse me. Uh, due to an emergency, entry into this area is prohibited. Sorry for the inconvenience. You call that a warning? <laughs> no, sir! <laughs> Work for me. That was a pretty good warning. He did a good job. Good job for that new recruit. There it is. Can I go up here? No. Sell me something. Clouds homecoming music. There she is. It's Tifa. Arlene. <laughs> Daddy, you're home. That's right, Angel. I am. <laughs> Have you been a good girl? Yeah, I've been helping <laughs> Tifa. Oh, you did, did you? Well, well. <laughs> you made it. <laughs> Where'd you get that? I can't remember the last time I saw a real one. <laughs> huh? Aww. <sighs> How sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? Oh, it says I lost it. Guy can change. Has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. The Mako place blew up. Everyone on TV's talking Eggs about and it. Chips. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? Who the hell eats eggs and chips? Let's talk to Marlene. Let's see if she'll talk to me. Talk to strangers. <laughs> That's right, honey. I do say that. What a good girl you are remembering daddy's lessons. You know what else good girls do? They go to bed on time. Come on. Aww. But I'm not tired. I want to talk some more, Daddy. Mm, all right. But just this once. <sighs> uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm Aww. still waiting on it. Uh, right. About that. We should talk outside. <sighs> um, Daddy? Did the people who died all return to the planet? Of course. Ooh, what can I do with this? Oh, cool. I can add songs to the jukebox. Huh. That's cool. Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but... I was thinking you could stay there for now. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? I'm leaving. Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me then. Oh. How was it up on the plate? It was chaotic. The Sorry for dragging you into all this. It was, it was wrong of me to put you in danger like that. News. I promise I won't do it again. Dangerous part of the job. 
Don't worry about me. <laughs> I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shinra. <laughs> not good at all. So, you make nice with everyone? As much as I could, all things considered. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. They'll spread whatever lies Shinra tells them to. One of my friends said so they saw it burning. It wasn't that bad? That oh, no, it was, it was bad. Oh, right. And here we are. Good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with Seventh Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Well, I want to see. Here's your room, 202. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean, I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? <clears throat> no, it's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. I want to know who. Tell me. Oh? It's a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always there get it. There is one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2,000, remember? I do. And we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. <sighs> and you're sure about that? Of course. As long as you help, that is. <laughs> Wait. Then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No. Two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves 1500 You're the best. Oh. I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. Leap cloud. <sighs> Jesus Christ, who gets out of bed like that? Guess it's time for introductions. God. This sounds terrible. You okay in there? Oh. Coming in. <coughs> oh God, Sephiroth's in there. The hooded figures. Yeah, those guys. What are you doing to Marco? This is his apartment. He's got a few problems, but he's not a bad guy. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure. 
Huh. <clears throat> Cannot be comfortable to sleep with that arm plate. Shoulder plate. Pauldron. Look over the room. Nothing still. Hey, it's daytime? Fake daytime? Okay. Ooh, I can go on the roof. Excuse my doggies. Keith, are you awake? No. Cloud won't even try. He's just going to shake his head at the door. Oh man, that hair. Well, now, you must be Cloud. Mm hmm. I'm Marl, your landlady. So, how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you mine. It can be about anything. Even Tifa. Oh. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. <laughs> you hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. Is your face always that pale? Oh. You're not getting enough sleep. Oh, it wasn't very nice. Let's see. I was thinking I might chat up on myself. The watch is saying they're up there. Searching for candidates. Absolutely. Who are you? Is that who Wedge mentioned? Mad sword's massive. What does he sell again? Yeah, it is. My sword's massive. That sword's massive. Thank you. What does he say? Searching for candidates. The trains don't start moving again. Don't try anything funny or you'll get it. The kids seem no to think here. Cool. Don't start anything no funny, you'll here. get it. What's the big sword for? Chopping up little kids. Uh, it's reactor one out of condition. Oh, kitty. There's so many people that just don't get their planet is a living thing. Oh, she put hey. the flower in a vase. Just so you know, Marlene's still asleep. <laughs> Let's get down to business, shall we? Huh? These water filters won't replace themselves. <laughs> Although the next batch probably could, if Jessie put her mind to it. Most every home in the area has one. Folks love them because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell. Honestly, oh, they make us more money than this place, and it's easy money, too. We bring new filters, collect the old ones, and get paid. What? <sighs> Give me a break. I'm not a salesman. I'm a soldier. Which is why no one will refuse to pay. What do you say? Uh, Please? Yes. <sighs> Let's get this over with. Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour. Oh. Wait. Can I grab any of this? Doesn't look like it. Go ahead and keep whatever we collect. Seeing as you didn't bring any luggage, I'm guessing there's stuff you need to buy. Thanks. And oh. don't worry. We'll pay you the difference after. Barrett's out making his rounds too. As long as I get it all today. Barrett sells meth. Mako meth. Huh. Hey there. Here to change out your water filter. Tifa, baby, how you doing? <clears throat> Been waiting for you to... Wait, who's he? Huh. Cloud's in charge of collections. He'll take your money. 
Sounds like a pretty sweet gig. If you ever need someone to fill in, I'm your man. In your dreams, maybe. Huh? Cloud! Uh, since we're here, maybe we should do a little shopping. Suppose I could take a look? I like the music he's playing. Oh, he's got materia. I don't have any ice. That's tempting. I mean, yeah, I'll buy that. Yeah. Thanks. And... Four. Thanks! If you're ever in the market for anything else, drop on by. <laughs> Especially if Teeth is with you. Ugh. We'll see you around, okay? And let us know when your filter next needs changing. Don't be creepy guy. All the items you could want straight from the plate. He's a regular. Stock up here and he might throw in a freebie or two. For you, maybe. <laughs> well, you could try being a little nicer. To get free shit? Oh, <laughs> <my> style. <laughs> Our next stop is Stargazer Heights. Landlady is a client. Just met her. Then you know what to expect. Remember, she's a good friend of Avalanche, so be nice. Please. Tifa has certain assets that let her get free shit. Just imagine if rich people start thinking it's safer down here than on the plane. My husband decided to go to the station and see if the. Hey, Marl. Got some filters for ya. Tifa! My dear, dear girl. Oh, what's he doing? Here? God, working. She looks like Isma nice. from Emperor's New Groove. <laughs> Cloud's helping me with collections. You better take care of her. I'm pretty good at taking care of myself, you know. That I do. Still, better him than you. No charm, no wit, big sword, but no skills. I've got skills. <laughs> Be nice. I'm doing my best. I've got skills. You're looking awfully glum. Are you getting enough sleep? A good long rest will cure anything, I tell you. A tried and true lesson for life on the ground floor, am I right? That you are. Now, your money. Thanks, Marl. You take care of yourself. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Not only am I staying there for free, she's paying me. Thanks, Marl. Marl's great. She helped get me set up back in the day. Admit, you been here a while now? Five years, give or take. Of those vets uh, but never mind that. Time. We've got to get you your money. Last stop is the weapon store. Hey, if it isn't Tifa. Oh. You here for the filter? Huh? Hey! That last filter didn't do shit! Uh -oh. We're so sorry about that. Hopefully this one will work better. Save your excuses and get out! All right. If you could just settle your bill, we'll be on our way. The hell? You charging me for your busted ass goods? Yep. My associate handles payment disputes. Think you can mosey up in here and have it your way? Pretty please. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> Seeing as we're done with our rounds and you've got a small fortune now, why not take a gander at the weapons? Well, when will Barrett be back with the rest? <sighs> Before we open up tonight. It'll be a while yet, so... <laughs> what do you want to do? Don't really know. In that case, I've got a suggestion. Want to hear it? If you're serious about becoming a merc, then you're going to need to start making connections. It's not what you know, but who you know, you know? You know? You know? Another lesson for life on the ground I know. floor. You know? Yep. Connections get you jobs. Jobs build your rep. And more rep gets you better connections. How do I start? Hmm. Why not help out the neighborhood watch? They're mostly volunteers, but you'll get to know people. Yeah, okay. Didn't see anybody at the office, so let's head up top. Wait, I want to buy some weapons first. Huh? 
I ain't got nothing for a punk ass bitch like you. Get yeah. on out of here. No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. Somebody's cruising for a bruise. Do something about the monsters. Huh? Didn't know you were holding down the fort. Huh? Oh, hey, Cloud. <coughs> Looking to join the neighborhood watch? That depends. What does this neighborhood watch do? Uh, stuff. Lots of stuff, really. But our top priority is taking care of any beasts that wander into town. That, and then teaching the locals how to defend themselves. Like they say, the only one who will look out for you is you. Cloud's a great fighter, but only we know that. If no one knows him, no one will hire him. Thought if he joined the watch, he could get his name out there. That would work for everybody. Truth be told, we could really use your help. We can't pay you in kill, but we'll work something out. For example, aha, uh -huh. what about your sword? I could mod it for you. No thanks. It's fine just the way it is. What, you some kind of purist? I know I'd never pass up a chance to improve my gear. Come on. At least let me show you how it's done. <laughs> yeah, it's a very nice sword. You can now enhance your weapons. Spend SP and unlock special skills infused in weapons. Use the upgrade weapon tab. Just let the character's weapon you like to upgrade. Excellent. The weapon you'd like to upgrade. Oh god. Unlock weapon skills and enhance your weapons. Okay. Magic attack. I feel like I want the health. And that. Cool. You can automate the SP allocation by selecting a weapon and pressing triangle. Cool. Only gonna level up characters. All set? Needless to say, you'll have to try it out to appreciate the difference. I got upgrade weapons. <laughs> we'll do you one better. Spread the word to everyone who'll listen about the new Merc in town. Between him and Wedge, there isn't anyone they don't know. I'll march through the streets singing your praises, even on an empty stomach. <laughs> so, where are these monsters? Scrap Boulevard. Good hunting. Hey, Cloud, I'll come with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I've got this. But you don't know the way, do you? Lead on. <laughs> wow. Sure thing. I know these streets better than anyone. She got him. We are going to save our game. We haven't done that. That's the very beginning. Come on. Supposed to keep the monsters out. Anyway, we should prepare just in case. Oh no, we're going. Good luck, Tifa, and be careful. Here's Scrap Boulevard. I can see why monsters would feel right at home. And the more we pile up, the more they show up. Huh. 
so when they drop the oh wait it goes out further <laughs> it's like if they drop the plane why not just run out of here uh spoilers and there's our first challenger show me what you got cloud <laughs> Damn, Tifa. Wow. So that's what a soldier looks like in action. This was just a warm up. Like a badass. Well, bad. Let's keep at it. Yeah. <laughs> that's that. God. Tifa took care of that on her own. You're good at this. Charging in like it was nothing. You too. It's a little surprising. Well, I've been here five years now. If you don't look out for yourself, no one else will. By the way, that one's gonna be on the test. This a lesson? Gotta learn if you're gonna stick around. Okay, let's wrap this up. <laughs> ah! He takes all the close range combat. He uses combos to deal lots of damage. Okay, let's go. Wrong one, Tifa. Come on. All right. I think that might be the last of them. He won't stay gone for long. Of course not. Even so, folks will be grateful for the peace and quiet in the meantime. Good. A win's a win, you know? True. Trust me, it'll do wonders for your rep. Right. Let's <coughs> go check in with Biggs and Wedge. Gotta keep them grateful for something, right? Alright. We're gonna go through the cave. Actually, we're gonna break the box. Then we're gonna go through the cave. Aha! More materia. Ice! I didn't have to buy it after all. Nice, we found the ice. Doesn't look like a perk. Hey! I have a sword bigger than you are. Don't talk shit about me. Swords and mass. What does he sell again? Back already? Yeah. Got every last one too. Now the slum should be safe. Oh, that's cool. You guys are machines. Good job. Meanwhile, we told everyone we could about you. You don't think so heard. I've got to ask though. What did you tell them? It's all right. All you got to do is keep up the good work. It'll pay off soon enough, I promise. How's the sword, by the way? Good. Glad to hear it. Seems like the perfect fit for you. Yeah. We've been through a lot. No, oh, no. Oh. You okay? I'm fine. My brain just hurts. Been meaning to ask. After you left the village. Town. It's a long story. I've got time. Why don't you tell me all about it while we try to wrestle up some more work for you? That sounds great! I'll come too! <laughs> uh, no, you won't. What? Come along now, you two. Sorry, Go on. maybe uh. next time. Huh? No fair! Uh, think about it for a second. They haven't seen each other in years. You'd be a third wheel. Uh, <sighs> Poor Wedge. Hey, before we get back to it, why don't you check out the weapons? No need. Come on, the dealer's probably heard all about you by now. Might treat you better. Mm. I don't know about that. Well, let's find out. Anyway, I was gonna say, since you can see the material in Tifa's gauntlet, if we have something that holds five pieces of material, we can make her the Infinity Gauntlet. You should just snap away the enemies. No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. 
Hold on. Heard there's a merc that'll take on any monster. You the man? Yeah. Word spreads fast around here. What if I am? Sorry about before. I get antsy when business is slow. <sighs> man in your line of work needs weapons, no? Why not try that one on for size? Yours on the house. Badass what? like you rocking my weapons is good advertising. Think about it. Fine. Or if you want to take a look at something else. Just a look. And people just handed him out free stuff left and right. What do you got, buddy? Ooh. Why is it a downgrade? Oh, it makes the most out of the material. So for one more spot of material, you lose 13 defense, 13 magic. That's rough. Holdproof vest. Oh, that's kind of cool. Huh. Don't be a stranger. You can now acquire weapon abilities. Once you achieve maximum proficiency in a weapon's ability, the ability becomes your own, and you can use it without the weapon being equipped. That's cool. Note that the best blade ability is at maximum proficiency from the beginning. Since you've got yourself a new weapon, let's see if we can't put it to good use. Yeah. Come on. Let's go chat up Weimer. Who? Good question. The guy who tracks all the requests that come to the watch. You never know. Could toss some work your way. Where is he at? Oh, he should be back at the office by now. Where's the office? Uh. Oh, it wants me to equip the new sword. <laughs> so I lose health. I lose health. Wait. Health and MP, but I get attack and magic? Focus thrust and only triple slash. Sure. We'll reslot. Oh, get it. oh there it is. You just opened cool. up shop in the area, didn't you? Alright, let's go for Weimer. Searching for candidates. Oh, hey there, Tifa. You need a helping hand? Actually, I wanted to introduce you to an old friend of mine. This is Cloud. He's a merc. Ah, you don't say. Well, we're always on the lookout for experienced fighters to help us deal with the bigger critters. I'll take on anything. For the right price, that is. Experienced and cocky, huh? If it's a challenge you want, I might have a few good ones. Huh. Your clients can fill you in on the details. Prove yourself at these jobs, and I'll see if I can't find you some more. Cool. Thanks. Side missions. Use the touchpad to access the map, and R2 to open quests. Cool. Candidate detected. Performing physical analysis. Huh. Sizable weapon. Excellent cardiovascular health and impressive lung capacity. Perfectly balanced muscle <laughs> and bone structure. An optimal candidate. My name is Chadley. I'm an intern for Shinra's Research and Development Division. I hope you'll be interested in helping me with my research. No. Please accept this as a down payment. I would like you to set that assessed materia in your equipment and use it to gather intelligence in battle. This data will help me to develop new types of materia. I'm not interested in working for Shinra. Yeah. You should know that I work actively to undermine Shinra's efforts. I'm sure you of all people can appreciate the tremendous power of materia as well as how it might be wielded against your corporate enemies. And if you later decide that I am not worthy of your trust, you can do what you do best. I will hold you to that. Excellent! Then we shall work together so long as you deem fit. Huh. Once you've completed your task, please return and report to me. When you complete battle intel missions for Chadley, he will develop new kinds of materia. You can view battle intel missions from battle intel in the main menu. Complete the missions while... while Respective quests are actively granted additional rewards. Interesting. 
Please set the orb of assess materia to your equipment and use it to gather battle intel. Okay. Extreme conditions for certain monsters I have provided them new curative abilities. Assess two enemy types. Okay. Well, we're gonna put it on clouds, I guess. Please set the orb of assess that. materia to your equipment. And you're our go-to monster slayer now. I can finally sleep. You'll never want for work around here if you prove yourself useful. Come on, Tifa. We gotta help this little girl. Oh, hey there. Uh, is Marlene with you? No. No. Oh, okay. I was kind of hoping she could help me find my friends. I know someone who can help you. This guy right here. <laughs> really? Okay, let me tell you all about them. They have long arms and legs, and they're a little skinny. They like places where there's food. And nice people will give them treats when they ask. And small spaces. Oh yeah, and they're all cats. I'm looking for cats? Mm -hmm. They're friendly, so if you call them, they'll come running. All three of them. Find my friends, please. Okay. They love crowded places, like the road to the station. A lot of people stop to play with them there. We're oh, looking for cats. Huh? Hmm. Cats. Who knew? <laughs> I need to play Final Fantasy VII and I'd be hunting for cats. Cat. These are all cats. This is a cat. Are these not her friends? It's just me, or there more strings around here. Recently. There's this one dude in the watch who's like, I still can't get it. A genius cat whisperer? Do you think we could Wait, get some money if we strip this thing just now? I think. There's a cat. Do I have to chase it down? Have more people than have you ever seen? Yeah, and they're all a bunch. Yeah, maybe. Have you ever heard this, man? Expect. I told Dad we're getting married and moving to the side. They'll also go wherever there's free food. Marlene says she always gives them some snacks when they go to 7th Heaven. Alright, so we go back to the little girl for tips, apparently. Next item on the Friends of Freshness agenda. Fear is in the mind. Funny fear is... What's the big sword for? Cutting up cats. It's so bad, we might have to close up shop. Here, kitty kitty. The Loveless musical was absolutely... People are counting on us. We have to close up shop. Aha! Found it. <sighs> One more. You won't get the bathroom. Which is better? One more cat. Let's see. Cats hanging out near the beginner's hall, too. You know the place. Is the one with all the houses around it? Um. <laughs> Lots of girls who live here. Next item on the front. Call us if you see trouble. Hey, Miss Lockhart, who's that guy you're with? 
Yeah. It's gotta be over here somewhere. Back here. Not, not it. Hello, hello! Oh, what do we have here? I'm guessing you're that merc I've heard so much about. Hey. You're not here to shop, are you? People were right. You look like you can handle yourself. So some drakes have made themselves at home in the abandoned Talliger factory. Can't have that kind of trouble around here. My regulars will do anything to get their hands on the scrap in there. And if they run into those drakes, they could get hurt. I'll handle it. Much obliged, sir. Didn't even ask Head on over price. to the old Talliger factory and talk to Nargen. He's the watchman guarding the entrance. Good luck. I'm counting on you, my friend. I'm looking for a cat. Hey, this looks like a bloodstain. Oh, mm. shit. Is that always there? I don't know how we missed it during the inspection. Here, kitty, kitty. You know. We won't be getting it. Hey, deep up in here. Go find somewhere else to hang out. I've been told the sewage stuff up. That's the little girl. Lots of girls in the huh? Oh. Yeah. Ah, the slayer is not the same as it used to be at all. Junk guy. Rat problem. Lost friends. This cat. Maybe we looks like I'm not the only one. My sister on the plate. Huh. You can do it. Hmm. I realize there are this many people that uh, Shinra crushed under the plate. Go ahead and get this quest too. <laughs> hey there, Tifa. Welcome back. And you. The new Merc in town looking for work, right? Yeah. In that case, maybe you could do something about the Doom Rats? Them Doom and Rats? Them and rat buddies have been tearing up town, looking for food and whatnot. Got into the store and made one hell of a mess, let me tell you. <laughs> oh, you think that's funny, do you? Don't lie. I saw you crack a smile. Well, do the job and you can laugh it up for all I care. Anyway. They're probably nesting in the outskirts. Now I've heard a were rat in pain will call its friends for help. And the whole rat pack will come running just like that. That music sounds like it's from Final Fantasy X. All the items you can pop straight from the plate. Hey, what are you doing in there? Looking good. I'm trying to get a cat to come out. Hey. It snatched one of my pastries and scurried in there. Will you be a deer and lend me a hand? Yes, I need that cat. Here, kitty. Here, kitty, kitty. This sucks. Uh, screw this. We found them all. Sorry about your cat, Betty. What? They ran away? Mm-hmm. So, you're never gonna see them again? You guys! You came back! They huh. said that a scary man was chasing them. <laughs> Thank you! Hey, we helped the little girl out. Cool. That went well! 
could be you found your calling. Yeah. It was alright, I guess. Think of each job as an opportunity. Not to make money, but to build connections. It's not what you know, but who. Exactly. <laughs> you remembered. Not a patient teacher. <laughs> Maybe not so patient next time. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, Barrett should have finished collecting his share of the money by now. So what do you want to do? Head back to the bar? More side mission. Cool. We're going to go ahead and end episode 3 there. Thanks for tuning in, guys. If you like what you see, consider giving me a thumbs up. Uh, if you'd like to see future content, consider hitting that subscribe button. If there's anything I missed uh, running around, leave me a comment down below and let me know so I go back and find it. And I will see y'all in the next one.